Hey coaches, I just wanted to take a minute and let you guys know that sometimes in the beginning it's hard. It's hard because you are overwhelmed, you don't know a lot about the business, and constantly hearing the word no can be extremely discouraging. So, for someone like me who has been in the business for a while. I'm not like a seasoned veteran or anything, but I, you know, I'm coming up on my year mark. And I know that in the beginning, I was extremely discouraged when people would tell me no. I would shut down. I would stop progressing. I wouldn't do anything. I just kind of, you know, let it weigh really heavy on my shoulders. I listened to this amazing podcast. It's called Entrepreneurs and Coffee. The very first episode is called Miracle Morning. I encourage you to go listen to it because it literally changed my business. Um, I, for the first time, have reached Success Club 2. <laughs> I know, right? But yeah, I'm excited. Um, also, the biggest piece of advice I took from that podcast was stay committed to your process without out being emotionally attached to the results. Do what you do every single day and do not let what someone says to you knock you down because they're not ready. You're ready for your change and you can't let someone who's not ready for their change hinder your progress or hinder your business because this is your business. So if you feel like maybe you need a little more encouragement or this was your problem too, please go listen to that podcast. Entrepreneurs and Coffee by Brennan Hufford, the very first episode. It's a good one. So I hope you enjoyed this little talk and uh, I hope I can expi inspire someone to, to pick back up like I did because I'm so proud that I did and I'm doing so much better now. So it's okay. It's okay to, to try again. You just need a new outlook. And that outlook comes from feeding your brain with knowledge and not garbage. Have a good day, coaches.